Yes, lovely people, welcome to another Kugali Spotlight, where we look at your favorite creators from across Africa and beyond. I am Zeke Nelson, a member of the Kugali team, here to talk to you today about Comic Republic, a Nigerian-based comic startup founded in 2013 by the invincible GD Martins. Ever since their inception, Comic Republic have been making waves, and their fantastic work has caught the attention of the BBC, Comics Alliance, The Guardian, and many other publications from across the world. But let's talk about the comics. Out of all the publishers in Africa, Comic Republic probably have the widest array of titles, so we'll only look at a few of them. Firstly, they have the flagship character Guardian Prime, also known as Tunje Jai. Every 2000 years, the All Father, who is God in this universe, sends a guardian to protect humankind. Wait, 2000 years? This reminds me a bit of... <coughs> Jesus! <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. As I was saying, many people have criticized Guardian Prime for being a Nigerian Superman, but this is actually an intentional gambit that Comic Republic have used to misdirect the expectations of their readers. So you go in thinking you'll be getting one thing, which is Superman says in Nigeria, but you read it and it's actually a very different story. Guardian Prime has two titles, Guardian Prime Genesis, which explores the character's origins, and Might of Guardian Prime, where his work as the Guardian is already in full swing. Both of those titles are available for free, that's right, for free, on the Comic Republic website, so be sure to check it out, links in the description. Next, we have probably my favourite female superhero from Comic Republic, Avanome, the story of Hilda Moses, originally born in 1937 in a remote Nigerian village. One day, Hilda mysteriously vanishes, only to reappear decades later in the modern world, not having aged a day. However, she has no memories of her past life, and soon discovers that she possesses strange ethereal powers, and can also communicate with spirits, beings that are usually invisible to the human eye. Avanome embarks on a quest to regain her memories, while also using her abilities to fight evil. Speaking of fighting evil, I wanted to look lastly at Iru probably the darkest hero in the Comic Republic lineup. Eric Kukui, Iru's human alter ego, poses as a lecturer at the University of Lagos, where he also doubles as a part-time psychiatrist and parapsychologist. However, when night dawns, he becomes Iru, the living embodiment of fear. Iru is now bound by an oath to punish evil and enforce justice by any means necessary. And he very much reminds me of Neil Gaiman's Sandman, because what you have is a situation where a deity who has existed for thousands of years is trying to live amongst men and really understand humankind. And I think this is actually the most interesting aspect of the story, beyond, you know, all of the gore and action, which is also great, <laughs> to be fair. And Iru is my personal favourite, but that's the awesome thing about Comic Republic. With several different titles, you're sure to find something that you like, and the best part is all of their comics are available for free. That's right, for free. You can go to their website, comicrepublic.com, and download any of the titles available there and not pay a single penny. So, before we close off, I should also mention that the founder, G.D. Martins, was actually on our podcast, The Tao of Otaku, and he's a really lovely fellow. We spend half of the time geeking out and the other half of the time exploring the inner workings of Comic Republic, so be sure to have a listen to that. Otherwise, go to Comic Republic right now. Once again, the comics are available for free on their website, so all you really need to do is, if you like what you read, then spread the word and let people know about the awesome work that Comic Republic are doing. As always, if you like what you've listened to, or what you've seen rather, then be sure to subscribe to our channel, where you'll be able to view more featurettes, more Kugali spotlights, and we also have other kinds of videos as well. Better yet, actually, sign up to our mailing list, and we will send you all of our latest videos, news, views, and reviews straight to your inbox. As always, it's been a pleasure, people. Thank you.